to Lazy Lamb here, and here we are back with some more Clicker Heroes at once um, more. Um, we've pushed a decent little bit since the last episode. I think we did only one ascension between, which is kind of what I'm doing just for Ruby's sake. Um, but yeah, relatively good jump. That's kind of what we were expecting. Um, nothing too crazy. Uh, how far away do we look like we are? Pretty still far away. Um, from getting Blanche. I forget exactly what level around we will get that. That is already at the end of our progress. We have five minutes on this, so we're not going to be doing our time lapses till then. Sadly, this is going to get a little bit wasted, but I, um, I will wait that out to hopefully get a Ruby quest. If not, it may not be on anything anyways. But let's get our uh, Ascension on. And as you can tell there, um, I think we missed it. Missed. Uh, we lost them last episode, but our other good Merc... Uh, is gone plus a life. I think we both have in last episode. If not, we're down one extra life on Brittany, which is scary Because that could mean No more Brittany and if no more Brittany means no more Ruby income and if no more Ruby income means Yeah, series ain't doing too hot So let's hope we get some arcs Because <laughs> if we run out of rubies, like I said, I would be in a pretty bit of a Spot where I'd have to kind of choose whether I continue going or not and it it would be very tempting to to look at the end being near for the series, which I don't want to happen, but um, if Mercs go that bad, you know, there's not much I can do. Not much I can do. Uh, let's get everything implemented here real quick. I think that's something super easy to do. Uh, and we're actually doing something new today, which is kind of cool. Uh, we're bringing back the questions of the day thing. Which I believe I only got one for, and I wasn't even really planning on doing it. I only picked one on purpose. Um, yeah, looks like we're there. Uh, one on purpose because they used the hashtag, which we're going to actually use. So you guys can let me know the questions that you're actually trying to get in the video versus the questions you just want me to answer in the comments. Um, so we're going to try to get it to be a thing on the channel, um, and we'll make it a weekly thing again. Um, we might only ever do like one question, just because these videos kind of are long as is. Um, might only be one question, um, might be no questions if nothing comes through. I'm not going to like worry about like you know hoping that you guys send questions through. If it happens, it happens. If not, it doesn't. Um, but I'll show you guys in a moment. Uh, we'll do it actually while we're still waiting for that five minute period to pass. Um, we get Cialatus. We get Nog. Let's eat Morg. And then we're set. As long as I did that right. Yeah, for a minute I thought I missed Pluto, but we didn't. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Because we waited, actually, we got that, which is going to put us a little bit farther. Um, actually, <laughs> it's not going to make a difference, um, to be completely honest. Who we're in, which one of those two. But the closer we get through those means starting on Ma at some point. Which will be great when we get to do our time lapse from Ma, which will bring Ma actually viable kind of usefulness back for a little bit. But uh, let me end this real quick and find the question, and I will come right back. Here's the question. I'm not gonna give any spoilers away, just for you guys know. So the hashtag is hashtag comment of the day, and then at, under it, you could even do the question first um, and pop it below. And I might choose some things that aren't comments of the day, but most of them I'm gonna choose with the hashtag. But have you watched Endgame? And how was it? Yes, I saw it. Um, I saw it the day it came out. Um, it was great. Absolutely loved it. Not the, my favorite Marvel movie of all time, but definitely an insanely awesome way to wrap a, you know, the past movies up, basically. Um, you know, it just, it's a good movie. I don't want to spoil it because it's still come out, and I don't like to really talk about new movies till after a month that they've been out. Um, so we're not going to get into details on it, but I did love it. I hope you guys liked it as well. If you guys have seen it, again, I... I, we generally kind of keep that out of out of any kind of combo like in the discord for example none of that stuff for at least a month um at least let it get through most of its theater time kind of thing uh but yeah that's the that um thank you for sending that in try caffeine pill thank you thank you for being our first return of the comment of the day but yeah if you got a comment you want to be featured in feel free to drop it below Ooh, that's perfect um Drop it below. Just hashtag comment of the day. It lets me know that it's not you're not looking for like a direct answer, um, and I'm not going to respond to them obviously in the comments because they're going to sit saved for the week after. Uh, and technically, you could do this on any of the videos, even if it's not a Click Heroes video. I might not notice it, but um, yeah. I mean, I may not notice it if you do it on on another one. As far as like 
saving and putting into this video. I mean, I'll obviously read it. I, I go through where the comments go. I don't look at video per video. It just kind of shows up all of the comments that I've kind of received uh, in one big blob. Um, it does show what video they're on on the side, but uh, yeah. I think it's a cool thing to bring back, though. Whoops. Um, back below 600 rubies is always a scary thing. I'm really just hoping the Merc makes it through. <laughs> like, the one life is so intimidating. They're such a high level already, but I mean, to be fair, they've had quite a few lives, so. What is it, three lives? Three lives on the Merc. This is taking forever. There we go. Um, sweet. Let's get you going and you going and oops I didn't mean to click it's whatever but um we can stop you dark ritual boom boom they lived ah so we have this rare mark as well I'm going to have to use the rubies would you like to use the bonus lives no yes we have to use rubies to revive them again they're level two like you gotta risk it at least it's only one life so I'm gonna probably go to like level 10 with it I'm not going to go too crazy. Um, I'll take the two day on you. I'll take the two day on you. Please give me like a decent one. Uh, I don't even want to really want to cycle that, but I'm going to do it. It's 15 minutes. Um, I mean, that could be 15 minutes. We might miss out on things, but hey, we're going to take the chance. Cool. We're in a solid spot there. Yeah, kill one for a 48 hour time lapse. We are definitely going down in rubies this episode, but that's why I don't really play much during the week. Like I could play, I could be going up a lot more zones than I'm going up. I could be getting in a whole another probably two, maybe even three ascensions a week. But it's like I'd be out of rubies. I would be done with rubies. Like, and again, when I run out, it's very gonna be gonna, gonna be super tempting to end the series, man. This is like upsetting. I'm letting both go. Like I'm not spending rubies on them. Um, yep, perfect. Perfect. Please just give me. I'm not going on a 30 minute one, so 15 minutes was already something I probably shouldn't have did. Another 48. Another 48. Yeah, we have to. It's too far out to me for me to stop this already. We're not even over a million zones yet. Ooh, the decline. We're going to be below 500 rubies again, which we did touch before, and it was a scary time. And that's when we got lucky with our Merc, um, which was over a month ago, easily. Easily over a month ago. Boom, boom. Hook you up on a decent crap quest. Same with you. Here we go. These are what I like. Four hours is also not super efficient, but I honestly, I think I'm just going to do the five-minute one. Eight hours is definitely more worth it. That wasn't going to be worth it for the whole... I think it was a, a two-hour quest or something. I may have even read it wrong. Maybe it was something I should have did, but... Um, all right, so we're going to do the last one, which is a 24-hour, and then I'm just going to let the game chill. We're going to relax. Um, again, taking the slow, slow road here. We're staying above 500 rubies. Hopefully next week we'll be back over 600 rubies before the start of the episode. Um, I do generally go up an all right amount, but, like, uh, it's still... So sketchy. Thank God. I hate looking at that every time. It is a terrifying. We're gonna be reviving them if they don't, so it's whatever. Um, I'd rather put them on a long quest. A five-minute ruby up here for sure. Forty-eight percent chance. No ruby quest there. Honestly, I'm just gonna do that as well to cycle it and possibly get another chance for a ruby up here. Um, but. We will get the golden clicks rolling. We will get our guilds moved down or over. Um, we don't need anything there, which means I can put them all down here, actually. Load everything up, and we are good. We'll pop over to the clan info in just a second. Alrighty, guys. So taking a look at things up at Lamination. We've got Kraken going up 209,000 zones, eleven less than 11k zones off of... Um, 500k, an insane jump, my dude. Congrats, that's that's crazy to be able to push that much. Um, honestly, I'm not really sure how you had the rubies to do that, but that's great, dude. Congrats. Uh, Linus here going up 155,000 zones, bring the 150k mark. Get ready for your wall, my friend. Judge generally where you hit the wall, although Kraken just flew through, so we'll see. Uh, Zach making some major progress, 76,000 zones, just shy of that 100k mark. Dude, congrats to you, man. I know, I think you're learning the game, right, if I'm not mistaken. 
I see you always like talking and asking questions in the Discord. I'm pretty sure this is your first time ever playing. You're like learning the game and um, like relatively new to the community and stuff. If I'm not mistaken, but um, dude, congrats, man. Uh, Joe Bro, only going up 150 zones. That ain't cool, man. That ain't cool. It's basically nothing, dude. That's nothing. Uh, Prez going up 2400, breaking that 16k mark. Hopefully next week, breaking 20. Uh, the unicorn going up at 1500, not breaking 10k this week. I was hoping, I think I mentioned last week, I wanted to break 10k, but nothing coming out. Um, Twisty didn't change this. We're sparing JK because he let us know there's an issue, but he still didn't mark it. It was a week one of him being absent. Um, I know Twisty's he's a little tired today, but <laughs> so we'll let him off. But a Wyatt new member coming in, 51. Um, I was gonna say 51,000 zones, but no. Um, 5100 zones coming in here and then um it's not Q-Zane is it is it just simply Q-Zane I guess that's it right like like there's there can't be much else to that Q-Zane coming in at 150 zones welcome welcome my friend nomination to uh Chungi only got up 2100 but Maybe, did you just transcend? I mean, obviously, it's you're getting to the point where rubies are tight. Um, or you were out of rubies, and that was one ascension all week. Ooh, yikes. Maybe that's the case, because I think about that point, you're only going up roughly that amount of zones in one ascension. That's a that's a big yikers. That is a yikers. Chatsu, I think, in a very... S oh, no, sorry. Not Chatsu, sorry. Uh, I was looking at something wrong. But Chatsu going up... Uh, 8,000 zones here, um, almost 9k, breaking the 30k mark, congrats dude, Anubis with the 1800 zone gain, uh, breaking 15k, um, not a ton of zones, but hey, not bad, not bad, pushing closer to that 20k mark, um, Cordy going up only about 1,000 zones, but hey, breaking 4k, still in that low level of the game, it takes, it takes a little bit to get pushing, especially if you're new to the game, trying to figure things out, it can take a little bit to get on your feet. Um, party gaming going up 2600 bringing that 3k mark and then two new members we got uh king aiden come or, sorry not king aiden night aiden coming in at 2200 there's a new king is there not i thought we had a new king member maybe i'm confused um i'm gonna be thinking of a different game but going up 2200 zone or coming in at 2200 zones as well as hazed coming in at 2200 zones two new members coming in at the exact same zone almost a uh, couple couple zones apart obviously but hey pretty close uh lamination three we got felix moving up five zones ambrose moving up five zones what is that what is that i remember toasty i think mentioning that so he's not going insane i'm pretty sure that is correct and let me just <laughs> just to be sure uh i'm gonna check for myself make sure their zones look correct there yeah that is right for both of them They've literally both move five zones that's kind of funny but also, like, dude, how? How do you only move five? Maybe they, maybe we took the zones last week, literally right at the end of their ascension, and they're out of rubies. So they both ascended after pushing one more wave of monsters, which would have been five. That had to have been it. They pushed five monsters, ascended, and then never ascended again. Like, they didn't even complete a full ascension. Probably both out of rubies. Let me know, guys. I'm curious. Are you guys out of rubies? Is that the problem? Is that the problem? It seems like it. Um, got some kicks coming this week. Wow! Now that I'm looking at it, we'll talk about it at the end. But um, we got Nornak coming in at 90, or going in up at 94,000 zones, breaking the 100k mark, as well as just about breaking the 150k mark. Congrats! Metroid going up uh, 25,000 zones, just shy of the 50k mark. Um, Torchic with 8k zones gained breaking that 20k congrats my dude that's what i was hoping um you definitely shined a little more there too um but zero going up 4,000 zones breaking that 20k mark awesome that's where i wanted you guys both to be there breaking that 20k mark sweet that's awesome congrats to you guys llama empire we got some fights going up um 12,000 zones uh, Sebi going up 56,000. That's another big jump there. Breaking that 200k mark. As well as Diaz going up 54,000 zones. Breaking that 200k mark. They're like neck and neck this whole way through right now. It's crazy. Uh, Christ's going up 15k. Almost 16k. 
Um, breaking them 150k. Congrats. Uh, FG going 60k zones. Breaking that 100k, which was just shy last week, as well as the 150k mark. Congrats to you. Uh, we got K Dog. Oh, 220 zones. Not much, dude. Didn't you have a low week last week? Or is that the week before? I know recently you either didn't move one week and we spared you. And then doing that, man, you can make way more than that. Come on, man. You got it. Um, and then two new members. We got Noah Boa coming in at 100 zones. And then Kitty Unicorn at 85. Um, hopefully, definitely seeing both of you guys, if not transcended, getting very close to 300 zones. Hopefully by next week. If you're having trouble, feel free to join the Discord. We can definitely help you out there. Um, and help you up with some tips <laughs> but uh over to our little clan graph here um you can see most of it obviously coming from llama nation they've had some really big dogs make some really big leaps uh but llama empire hanging in there we kind of kept up not, not i mean about half their zones but hey it is what it is you can see the progress there you can't even see llama nation 2 but llama nation 2 is 21,000 zone game not much at all very little progress a little upsetting but I can't even say there are a lot of lower members. On to that point, though. A lot of kicks coming this week, guys. We got one from Lamination. It looks like two from Lamination. Two. Three from Lamination. Three. And one from Lamination. Four, guys. If you're looking to get in the clan, this is the week. Bunch of kicks coming. Uh, nonetheless, if you guys enjoyed the video, please take a second. Smack the like button. And as always, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.